what were some of your guys' favorite Vancouver locations? Oh, for me, we shot on the sixth floor of the CBC building downtown. That room was KPOC. So this 1980s broadcast journalism office. And I mean, we just had the best time shooting there. It was a time when like a ton of the cast was all in the scenes and we were decked out in our 80s gear and playing ourselves at 20, which has like a whole other energy to it. And then like the talk show that Older Tully has, that's also in the studio. So most things that were in the 80s were in the studio. So Firefly Lane is out in, um, well, Firefly, Firefly Lane is out in Langley. Just stunning. I've lived in Vancouver my whole life. I've never been out to Fort Langley. But where has this been on my life? The CBC studios actually doubled as part of the Malarkey House as well. So it's established in Langley, but my room was actually in the CBC. We film in CBC, me and Katie, we leave, door opens, cut to Langley inside the house, us walking down the stairs. These, these old heritage homes that are just beautifully surrounded by the countryside. They're just real houses that are exactly across from each other, just like that. But the inside of like the kitchen of my house was actually in the house on Firefly Lane. So it was kind of just like the insides of our rooms or like any bathrooms was in the studio. Yeah, there's a school that they use in Riverdale, which I forget, and I was like, oh yeah, it's at one kid's high school. It's always the one that doubles as like every high school to go to. And we used like the gym of the schools and, and the inside building of the schools. We filmed in, in, in the North Shore where I grew up, uh, which was also really cool. Sarah Chalk's family's house was, like in Horseshoe Bay. We shot at a house in West Van and the view uh, you know, right across to Point Grey. It was so spectacular. And we got to shoot there in the snow. We shot there in the rain. I thought I could drive there in the snow in a rear wheel drive car. And for some reason I forgot how steep the hills in West Van are. So I ended up getting stuck. Everyone was safe, no worries. They came, had to come and pick me up. You talked a lot about CBC, but you didn't mention that they shot outside of Daily Hive. They're filming outside of Homer Nelson. And I was like, that's where Daily Hive is. Yeah, that was right down in, in Yale Town across from Granville Street Bridge. So you could see those interestingly painted, I'm not sure what you call them, silos maybe. There was some debate of whether that was gonna be shot inside or outside that scene. And at the last second, they were like, okay, we're gonna shoot it here. It's gonna be outside. And I think the art department just like threw that gazebo together. I mean, I wonder if they left it there. I, I haven't, I haven't gone, and <laughs> gone and checked. Our base camp when we were shooting downtown was right across from Cirque du Soleil. And so one day oh. my, I had like a scene off and my break timed out exactly for like the matinee performance of Cirque du Soleil. <laughs> I really walked across the street, saw Cirque, it was spectacular. And then went to my next scene. It was, it was so cool to shoot in Vancouver.